Lee Vo. Spike, the 80-pound Rio Rancho runaway tortoise, gained national attention this week. Now he's become the poster child or poster tortoise for exotic pet permits. KOAT Action 7 News reporter Regina Reese explains it's actually the law to register pets like Spike. Spike loves to eat. This African spurred tortoise will end up weighing more than 100 pounds. I call him my turtle, and then everybody's like, that's not a turtle. He's a huge tortoise. <laughs> Recently, Spike took up a new hobby, joy walking. He was just wandering down the road. He was happy as a clam. When a gate was accidentally left open, Spike took off and wound up a half a mile away from his real rancho home. Animal control picked him up. Audrey, his owner, was cited because she didn't get a permit to have Spike. You see, Spike is considered an exotic pet. No, we never did. Um, I didn't. I thought it was he was just, you know, a regular pet, and I mean, I really didn't think we had to register him at all. Now Spike has become the poster child or poster tortoise for exotic pet permits in Rio Rancho. What uh, Spike brought to light was the fact that there are many residents in Rio Rancho that have exotic animals. And by law, owners of these non-native animals have to have a permit. They're 50 bucks the first year and $10 every year after. Officials will also stop by and inspect your home. There's a concern for public safety mostly. Uh, we don't want to have these animals not secured properly. So it gives us a chance just to check to make sure that they're caring for the animal and they're protecting the public at large. Now that Spike has his permit. I really didn't think he was going to ever take off that far. And the gate has a padlock. All is well in tortoise land. Reporting in Rio Rancho, Regina Ruiz, Action 7 News. If you need more information, you can go to the City of Rio Rancho's website. You may have noticed some changes here on Action 7 News. That's because we've made the move into high def. It's taken